topic that we are going to see today is multiplexer or MUX. The characteristic of MUX is that we are having multiple input and single output. For example, I am having four input line. Let us the name of input line is D0, D1, D2 and D3. So this is 4 is to 1 MUX as we are going to have four input lines and only one output line. Except that we are having two select lines. Now how to find out that how many select line will be there. So for that we are having formula to the power 2. As we are having 4 input, 4 can be represented as 2 to the power 2 where 2 are the select line. Now there are one characteristic equation for this 4 is to 1 max. So the characteristic equation is that when both are active low that is S0 and S1, D0 will be selected. When S0 is 1 and S1 is at active low, D1 will be selected. When S0 bar and S1, D2 will be selected. And when both are active high, D3 will be selected. This is the output equation for Z. What we have to remember about MUX is that this characteristic equation. We can similarly write down the characteristic equation for 2 is to 1 MUX. In 2 is to 1 MUX, there will be two input line D0 and D1 and there will be single sing select line that is S0 and one output line. So this is how your 2 is to 1 MUX will look like. Now let us see what is the gate question that has been asked in examination. They have given you 2 is to 2 marks connected in this way and they have asked you what will be the minimal sum of product equation for x. Now first we will find out the sum of product equation for first marks and that will be given as an input to the next marks. So let us find out the characteristic equation for marks 1. Okay, so this will be the equation we will take as it is for the next, this is 2 is to 1 marks. So the output here is suppose z. Okay, let this will be a z. So the output z is equals to, as it is a 2 is to 1 marks, which is required as 0 bar into 0 or we can say d0 plus s0 d1 here if you see this s0 is nothing but p that is the select line and the 0 that is d0 is nothing but 0 and d1 is nothing but r so our characteristic equation becomes p bar into 0 plus r into p so that is equals to rp now let us find out the characteristic equation for the second mark and the output will be x. So x is equals to again s0 bar d0 plus s0 d1. Here q is a select line so s0 becomes q and the input 0 that is d0 is nothing but r bar this is your d0 and what about d1. So d1 is nothing but the z and the value of z is rp. So Rp is D1. Now substitute these values over here. S0 bar that is Q bar. D0 is nothing but R bar plus S0. S0 is nothing but Q and D1 is nothing but Rp. So the final equation becomes Q Rp plus Q bar R bar. So this is what will be the characteristic equation or the output X for this MUX so this is the simple 2 is to 1 marks and we have also seen the 4 is to 1 marks. So can you can easily find out the output or the by using the characteristic equation of that marks whether it is a 2 is to 1 or 4 is to 1 marks.